I wanted to run another test with the, uh, Turn this down. With the uh, Tempest and the Molots on Leo. And I wanted to run it because somebody was asking me uh, how many, how accurate is it at 800 meters? Uh, and I couldn't tell them. So I wanted to come back here. Uh, it was a clan mate that had asked me that. I have a Gareth out there. It is a level 8 Gareth, I believe, uh, at 800 meters with his shield in front of him. Now, I know I can take down that Gareth, I believe, unloading one time at 350 meters or pretty close to. So we are going to... Yeah, it's not even... Uh, not even really touching them at 800 meters um let me see if i did any damage i'm gonna look on the other screen it's me on the other side uh it did very little damage i can look at my screen right here so let's move it up to 700 meters sorry about that sorry if you can hear the screaming in the background it's my kids so now we're uh came up 100 meters and still Still just doing very little damage. And mind you, I was taking out a Natasha in like half. Maybe it was one mag. It might have not been uh, half a mag. So we'll move up to six. Um, we got maybe a quarter damage done <laughs> on the... Uh... <laughs> oh, I need some soundproofing. Uh, so at 600 meters, it's taken substantial damage. We did a, about a quarter damage to it um, at that distance. So I want to get right up on it and uh, see what it does. Because from what I'm told, the Molots will just go around Gareth. I picked the smallest bot I had, um, you know, profile-wise. I wanted it to be very small. I looked at Stalker first, but Stalker's kind of wide. Not really, but with his weapons he is. So you can see it's probably, what, two-thirds down. So I want to get right up on it and just see what it does. I want to look at, I'm going to look at my other screen here on my uh, tablet and see exactly what it's doing. See if the guns are actually pointing at them or if the bullets are just going around them. So we'll get up to about 50 meters. No, we'll get closer. I want to be right up on them. You know how them gears get right up on you and run around you. So on the other screen, it looks like uh, all the barrels are pointed towards them. Let's see if all the bullets hit them. Yeah. More or less, you have a few... Uh, a few of the side molots going, you know, off to the side. Some of those bullets from the uh, two furthest ones out. But as far as, uh, so let's see. Let's just play around a little more. We already have it out. We already have the game going. Already have it recording. May as well play around. This is a Natasha. Uh, and we'll get right up on it. And it's a big wide bot. So let me start walking this way with the Natasha, though. That way I'm not spending my whole video here walking to each other it's kind of hard to control two robots at one time uh oh I'm turning the wrong one hold up there we go well that was quite difficult to do so we're just going to come in at around 100 meters and I'll, I'll show you. Uh, yesterday I think I did it at about 350 and I want to say it was one, uh, one round but I'm not positive. So we'll go ahead and unload these. You can see that Garrett though took a lot of damage from these uh, guns. Natasha doesn't do so well. It's a wider bot. We'll get in. What were we about right there? So yeah, I can plainly see all the bullets are hitting it. And you can see with one mag it took it down. It did the same thing at 350, so um, 350 and under with these things, they're still really deadly. I like them. That's going to be it for this one. Thanks for watching, YouTube.